Okay, so I think this is part six or seven. I don't know, uh, but uh, I've got some textures here. Uh, so let's work on the on these inside walls. So I'll first hide all my lights and uh, let's uh, go to texture mode here or look dev mode here and uh, look at uh, the walls. Add new material. Uh, bring in my texture. Let's look at that doesn't look like much maybe because I don't have uh, this UV unwrapped I also want this to use the same texture so control L material and uh, then and give it object mapping uh, because I don't want to if you unwrap anything here so box mapping as well now if we preview this again uh, we should look at be seeing uh, the materials now we just need to scale that down uh, the texture just a bit and I don't like how uh, the seams are there so let me offset the that's the Z location so that we're not seeing those a lot maybe blend that a bit can also mix it with a uh, different texture I have here let's drop it in here I think I can give it the same mapping. I make sure I, this is set to box as well, and then I can uh, mix other two. Let me try overlay. Let's try soft light. screen let's try let's try soft light and see that doesn't change much but I want to have some bit of control over the color uh, the overall color so I'm just going to add another mixed RGB uh, this time set it to overlay and uh, that way you can control the color just a bit then fit this to the base color now we can preview this here and then we can fit this to the roughness but uh, to control the roughness are we going to add a color ramp and then math node now we can use this slider to control how rough uh, the object is and uh, this where that roughness should be or what should be the maximum roughness of the of any pixel or yeah something like that Perfect. Now, what else do we need? Uh, we need uh, some bumps here, so I'll just add a convert. Sorry, a vector bump. Connect this to the height, and then this to the normal. And now we have bumps. Uh, that's a bit too much. I can invert this, I think. Uh, then. Reduce the bump. I need very little bump, bumpness. Maybe increase the roughness just a bit. And, uh, And for this, just going to give them a metallic surface. We 
is a bit reflective and maybe make it a bit darker and uh, this here should be a light material should be a light Uh, we can add a texture for the roughness uh, this I think is also a very simple object so I can just use smart UV unwrapping for this and find a texture here are my textures I'll just reuse uh, this here for the roughness actually for the roughness of this metal apply this here roughness of this metal and uh, control it using a math node here not too bad let's see what else yeah everything else I think should be left for uh, the lighting uh, the ceiling here I will be using if I isolate it this ceiling the rest of this make sure I'm saving this so the rest of this so I need to select this and this actually no should use uh, the concrete material and at uh, the bottom of this shift G shift G no more should also use the concrete material and uh, the outside edges here should use a darker version of the carpet like you see here so have to duplicate that material and uh, just add mix RGB and then overlay change this color just a bit make it a bit darker So let's try to see if uh, this would render how this looks. I think that a light here is a bit out of place, so just going to remove it.
Yeah, my PC can't really handle this. It's just too laggy, and I think uh, one of the reasons is because I'm kind of rendering this. I'm, I'm also recording this. I think we can go in and uh, add an environment texture, an HRI image. So let's find one. And uh, we need to be a little bit darker in here, and uh, these lights as well. the original light which is supposed to be around here and I think these walls are a bit too bright so a bit dark and uh, maybe this light panel also at the top so this wall looks a bit too reflective so let's fix that this light panel here. I think I, I'm going to substitute that for concrete. And I uh, also might remove uh, this HDRI image. Yes, so, so, so we don't really have too much light coming in. You can select this light. Uh, I might want to increase that just a bit sure what these are reflecting right now I think we're going to need a little bit more light here. But uh, yeah, my machine is not really doing me justice here. Uh, I think the most of the work I'll have to do offline are because uh, recording this on this machine is just slowing everything down. Thank you.